Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Fallout 4. Alright, when we left off, we had, uh, just gotten done doing a little bit of upkeep to, well, Sanctuary, our main home, which of course is the only thing I do upkeep for anyway. And, uh, turns out I was right, rad stags do give leather, and it is a significant amount of leather, so, good thing I set up this trap. But, uh, I was talking to, uh, well, Preston, who was right over here, well, was. Where'd he go? Oh, he's over there now. Anyway, I was talking to him to, uh, get the other quest for, uh, Somerville Place off my, uh, map. To get that done and over with, because it was done and over with. And... He gave me... What was it? Yeah, a second. Clearing the way for Nordhagen Beach. And... I have two of these. That's the first I've seen of that. Okay. Ah. Uh, I guess I gotta do both. Of these, but one of them for uh, Abernathy Farm. So we'll head to that because that's pretty close. Uh, actually, very close. I just need to really head that way. So onward we go. All right, just making sure there's nothing gonna pop up at me on the way. If you heard my neck crack, I apologize. That was not intentional. I was trying to pop it real quick, and then I realized, ooh, that's kind of loud. <laughs> I apologize. But you probably didn't actually hear it, so now you're just thinking I'm a crazy person. What the flying fuck? Okay. Come on, really? That didn't hit? At all? How about if I hit the body? Nope, that would take a lot of shots. There we go. Just trying to go for the quick and easy. Well, that's gone. And how about you? This should be easier. Perfect. Well, that's dealt with. Any more? No? Nope. Okay. You're safe now, Brumman. All right. Uh, ooh. Have some booze just sitting around. Hell yeah. And Kate will probably... And uh, That should not say probably. She does not care. Uh, if booze is consumed, if, but, uh, if any more drugs are consumed, she will start to dislike me. Uh, it's just a very minor thing now, since she's been, you know, cured of her addictions. She, uh, now considers anyone who indulges in chems to be risking a lot and just does not like it anymore, which is understandable might I add, but I uh, felt I should mention that in case some people were confused later on if I had to pop one in an emergency just for the effects and uh, oh this is where their daughter died and this is well, this was her daughter was buried after they uh, after the raiders had killed her originally, yeah I forgot it was back here Forgot there was a lot of stuff back here, actually. Got rounds, got some fusion cells, ammo. Perfect shit. How about no, Kate? We've talked about this before. It's fine. It's all fine. It's fine. The hell is over there? Um. I think I remember what that is, but I don't need to go over there quite yet. However, I do need this blood leaf. So I'll be sneaking a little bit. Oh yeah, I leveled up when I brought the uh, Somerville mission back to... Uh, da, 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 back to Preston, so I could probably do that level up now. Deal with that. Ah, there's the music been a while since I heard that. Uh, where do I want to put it is the question. Well, 
I can put it in armor or into gun nut, which quite frankly is the one I want more. <laughs> uh, I will eventually start devoting points to that, but not right away. Um, let's, let's put it into this. Put it into this first. Everything... Ah, oh, okay. I was wondering why these were still showing stars, and it's like I didn't have any points that I was hiding in the back pocket, was I? So I didn't remember them. There we go. Get some hub flowers after getting some blood leaf. It's all good shit. And I want to stay away from those as well. Because that whole area is just a fucking hell. <laughs> just a fucking hell. Okay, I was wondering what that pile was. Oh, hey, Lucy. Hi there. I want to trade a few things. Yeah. Just to make sure you have enough stuff is all. Ah, uh, you don't really need that many rounds. To be perfectly honest. Uh, there we go. Thank you, Lucy. Hey, hey Blake. I am glad to see you. We could really use a hand. Yeah, I heard. What do you need? Get to the point. What do you need? A pack of feral ghouls has wandered in nearby. It's too risky to have them so close, and we need someone to clear them out. Yeah. Damned feral ghouls. We appreciate nope. the help. I know it's an inconvenience. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just being pissy so Kate doesn't, you know, think I'm going soft, which is the main thing she complains about whenever I'm helping people. Kate. All right. Though... Shipping yard is actually right over there, so this is actually relatively easy <laughs> as far as quests go. So, just want to deal with these because they're right over here. I figure might as well. Whoopsie! Oh! There's a legendary festering bloat fly. Did not expect that. Alrighty. Whoa, that was quick. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Okay. I can deal with a black bloat fly, no problem. So I should probably be dealing with that that guy first. Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Come on now. There's that dealt with. Oh, really? Okay. This has something on it. Ah! That's what it had. Cavaliers. Cavaliers, rather. I don't fucking know how that's supposed to be pronounced. There's, there's different versions of everything. Uh, reduces damage while blocking or sprinting by 15%. Eh, kind of worth it. The land is probably more worth it than anything. Uh, fuse. Why was that one carrying a fuse? That's weird. This guy, uh, this guy deaded. Well, he must have. I have no idea what happened to him. Actually, now that I think about it, I probably shouldn't ascertain to guess because I'm probably wrong. I can't like that. Glad you like that so much. Holy shit! I just realized my health. Holy shit! What the hell? Did those things actually bring me down that far in health? How'd that happen? What? Okay. Uh, don't need the grilled rad stag yet. Uh, don't need to worry about weight for a while yet. But what I should have is that ribeye steak there. As well as... Nope, not popping that yet unless I need it. Um, sure, let's pop a stingwing fillet. Why not? Should help with uh, Vats auto. Well, Vats aim, not Vats auto aim. Oh boy, I'm using the wrong words every single moment. Ah, oh, jeez. I am uh, either very much asleep or very much having a stroke. Have not yet figured out which. Um, I could just use 10. Millimeter ammo instead. Uh, 
Yeah, I probably should be using this in regards to these guys. Hi there, buddy. Oh, geez. That, oh. Well, I think, yeah, Dogmeat has that pretty much handled. And I think that was the only one really around the front area. For the rest of it, I think I should be sneaking. So. Kate, the fuck? <laughs> Alrighty. All uh, right then. Oh, geez. That's some radiation right there. Uh, this doesn't really have much in here, but at the same time... I kind of want to be in here to check, at the very least. There we go, now let's get out of here. Dog meat, you are making it hard to get around. Come on, a doofus dog. Alright, there should be a couple of them in here. Okay. There we go. There's that one dealt with. Reload. Perfect. Duct tape. That I can never turn down. Wicked business. Have I could have sworn I've been here before, haven't I? No? My own file I'm thinking of? Probably. Okay. I've been here at least three times on my own file. Anyway. Let's pop that. I mean, what kind of business partner threatens to kill you if the deal doesn't go his way? Yeah, that's a good point. Way over our heads, man. I can't see a way out of this. No way except shutting down and getting out of Dodge. Give me a chance to talk this out with you face to face. I just want both of us to get out of this. Well, I mean... This body here, this body over here with a 10 mil auto pistol, suggests uh, that didn't work out the way they uh, that he had intended. Or at least that's what it sounds like anyway. Eh, I don't know. But uh, Eddie, I assume, is Eddie Winters, the uh, mobster guy... Uh, flipping on his friends. Or at least that's what it sounded like in his own tapes. Uh, trying to get them caught by the police. In some sort of plea deal. Okay, who's getting... Oh, it's over there. There's that one dealt with. A couple more rounds than I intended to shoot, but that's fine. Hey, I got some back from that guy. Hey, that's <laughs> ah, fine with me. I should reload. Perfect. I could swear there was more, though. I could have sworn there was more ghouls. Over here, maybe? No. No, 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 no. I have to go around the other way to get to that one. Uh, or not? What the? Huh. Nope, this one's dead. Plasma cartridge. Plasma cartridge. What? There we go. The mystery station. There's nothing really new. Especially nothing I can make offhand with materials I have on my person. All right. Uh, nothing. Okay. It's... Oh, this is... It's an expert lock I can pick, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh. <laughs> but I fucked up there. Ah, uh, come on. Where's the spot? Ah, I'm getting there. Ah. A little bit to the right. There we go. Beautiful idolizes you what what is that the last bit that i need hey need something hey do you have a minute i think we should talk really 
I always have time to listen to you, Kate. Good. Because this isn't easy for me to say, but I want to get it right. Uh-huh. Where do I begin? Did you know I spent three years fighting at the combat zone? Three years of getting beaten to hell by a bunch of losers and lunatics. After the matches were over, I'd spit out the blood, stitch me wounds, and do a couple of shots of Psycho to keep me going. I fucking hated it. I hated the crowds, I hated the other fighters, and I hated myself. I never understood why I put myself through all that. Until now. It was because I was alone. And I think deep down, I wanted to die. I wanted one of my opponents to crush the life out of me. The easy way out. Yeah. That is... Yeah. Yeah, you're not alone anymore. Well, that's the past. So. You're not alone anymore. Then maybe you know what I'm trying to say to you. My life's been nothing but one huge failure after another. You've heard all my stories, and you know the prices I've paid. Yeah. There were a few times when things got really bad that I... I found myself staring down the barrel of my own shotgun. Oh, shit. I don't know why I didn't pull the trigger. I guess I was praying that I could find a single decent scrap of humanity in this fucked up world. Yeah. And then, what you did for me back there at Fog 95, it was like the answer to those prayers. That's the first time in my life I fully depended on someone else, and they didn't let me down. God damn it, I'm making a mess of this. Not really. It's, I understand what you're saying. It's all right, Kate. Let it all out. I'll be fine. I just need to be getting to the point. All right. The longer we've been spending time together, the more I'm beginning to realize what you mean to me. And I'm not just talking about you watching me back or sharing a drink together. Yeah. I mean more than that. Before we met, I'd never let me guard down around anyone. I didn't dare. But with you, yeah. I feel like I can let you in and see me for everything that I am. For better or for worse. Look, I can't go back to the way things were before we met. I won't. But what I'll I need blame you to do is look me in the eyes and tell me you feel something too. Of course I do. I'm in love with you, Kate. You... you're what? Oh, come on. Come on. Really, game? Really? Okay, give me a second. Oh, are you for real? It puts me all the way back here. Okay, God damn it! Give me a second. Well, I managed to proc the idolize at a different spot, so um, uh, here's a quick save to make it easier on me, just in case this happens again. Just fuck. I always have time to listen to you, Kate. Good. Since we just listened to all of this. You know give me a second. Alright. If the game does it to me again, I'm giving up. <laughs> I'm going to do it in the next episode. Cause fuck. God damn it. Of course I do. I'm in love with you, Kate. You you're what? You said you're in love with me. I I didn't know. I mean, I felt something between us, but I thought it was something else. Why? Why would you fall in love with someone as screwed up as I am? Finally, thank God. Because you're special to me, Kate. And I don't think I'd be happier with anyone else. It's a little cheesy, but I know. You really mean that? Yeah. This has to be the first time I put all my cards on the table and didn't end up losing everything. You don't know how much this means to me. To have someone special in my life. I promise you. I mean to make the most of it. Having reached the highest level of affinity with Kate, you have gained the Trigger Rush perk. Yay! And finally... Yeah. Finally we have a romantic companion in Kate. Which is what I'd been aiming for... This whole time. Okay. For some reason, it managed to proc when I was unlocking that thing, when it didn't un uh, didn't proc when I was doing 
until I was doing that one. So I don't know. I don't know why it changed, but hey, it works out in my favor. So I don't mind. But uh, now I'm going to do that mission in the next episode because I'm quite a bit over time. <laughs> I do not have time to fix it. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in, in the next episode if I can talk right. <laughs> This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games and finally getting a romantic companion in Kate as well as helping out a couple of our neighbors for you.